When he was a young man, Nicholas boarded a ship bound for the Holy Land. Following in the Lord's footsteps, Nicholas prayed that he could be able to experience Jesus' closeness more fully and share in his sufferings. On his way back to Greece, a terrible storm occurred, and the ship that he was on was in danger of flooding. Nicholas silently prayed, and the wind and waves immediately stopped, much to the surprise of the sailors, who were terrified of a shipwreck. After St. Nicholas passed away, his tomb and mirror quickly became a pilgrimage site. His remains were believed miraculous due to a strange liquid that flowed from them, known as the manna of St. Nicholas. After the Turks captured Lycia in the 11th century, Venetians attempted to make him their patron. However, seamen from Bari were able to acquire his relics first and took them to their 